everyone, so I wanted to share with you some of my newest purchases from a couple stores um, that I went to today. I did some errands and I stopped at Ross, Ulta, and uh, Walmart. So the first things that I got from Walmart is just two things. I'm going to just show you real quickly. I got the new Rimmel. Well, it's not really new, but it's been out for a little bit. It's the new uh, BB cream, the Beauty Bomb. It's a 9-in-1 skin perfecting um, BB cream with an SPF of 25 and I got the shade light and it's supposed to the 9 in 1 it's primes, moisturizes, minimizes pores, conceals, covers, smooths, mattifies, brightens and helps protect last all day. So hopefully this works. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to work with my oily skin because I do use the Garnier BB cream that's made for oily skin and I like that. But I kind of wanted to try something else because there's so many of them. I might find one that I may enjoy even better. Um, so I bought that to try it. Um, and I also got the Maybelline Dream Lumi uh, Highlighting Concealer. Illuminates, hides, and hides imperfections. I got the shade Radiant. So it's the just the bright, the pinky one to brighten up the under eye area. Um, this one, it shows the diagram on the back. You can use it um, around your um, mouth. You can use it on your nose, on the sides of your nose, on your cheekbones, and under your eyes. So it's kind of like a, it's a gel-based concealer. So we'll see how this works because I do love the um, one of their concealers that I'm just loving. Um, was my must be my son making this. So then I went to Ulta. I got two things from Ulta. So let me take them out the bag because it can get kind of loud. The first thing I got was a dry shampoo just so that I can you know try. I did try one from Big Sexy Hair a while ago, a couple years ago, and I was not a big fan of it at all. So I got this one. Um, it's the it says the True Original Instant Dry Shampoo. Um, let's see, and it's the brand. Psst, I don't know. That's just the weirdest, <laughs> the weirdest brand. Psst. Like that's what I use. And so, oh, what dry shampoo do you use? I use. Psst. I mean, <laughs> that's just crazy to me. They should have chosen a different name, but I guess people will remember it because it's kind of like a different name. I wasn't sure if I should have gotten this one. Or I think it was SG Graphics, something graphics that was standing right next to this as well. But let's see how this works. It refreshes and revives, extends blowout and color life, absorbs excess oil, builds volume on the go. So I hope it's good. It's a 5.3 ounce bottle. And I think that had, they had them there for $5.99. So it's affordable. And then I got this little mini um, Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Texturizing Sea Salt Spray with infused with dead sea salt and sea kelp. This is a two ounce bottle, and I think these were like three bucks. I wanted to try because I've never tried anything from this line, but I've been wanting to try a texturizing spray. I was gonna get the one, I think Bumble and Bumble is the one that makes um, a texturizing spray, but they're kind of pricey, so and I didn't want to buy it without knowing if I'm really into this stuff because I guess it's supposed to make your hair feel, uh, feel a little bit, um, I don't know, like a little bit drier because the sea salt is supposed to give you tousled wave look. Um, it has a light matte finish to any hair type. So we'll see. I'll keep you guys posted. Then my finds at Ross. This Ross is actually, you know, somewhat organized. Most Rosses that I've been to are just like a mess. Clothes everywhere on the floor. It's dirty. It's disgusting. I walk in and walk right back out because I just, oh, it just irks me to have that um, messiness. So I got a couple beauty things. The first thing is my Rimmel um, Scandalize Mascara. This is the with the Lycra. I think I'm pronouncing it right. Flex Mascara. Builds volume in extreme black. And I got this because I I used to use one of the mascaras way back in the day before YouTube. And it was, you know, pretty decent. And I've always wanted to try their newer ones. But this one was only $2.99. So I figured why not um, try it. And it looks like it has, you know, pretty uh, big brush there with some good bristles. So this is 50% larger, uh, flexible, buildable volume. So we'll see. The next thing I got was a cosmetic blending sponge from Earth Therapeutics. So I've been wanting to get the beauty blender. Maybe that'll help me um, give me a different finish to my BB cream and other foundations besides using my uh, brush that I use from Sigma that I love. Um, I would, you know, thought that maybe this would be better. So I got it, um, it says, uh, let's see, the sponge is reusable. I think I'm going to wet it and see what it does when it's wet. Um, hypoallergenic, I guess, I don't know. So I'll keep you guys posted on this works. This was $4.99. So then, the next thing I'm pretty excited about, 
I've been wanting to try the Sally Hansen um, Salon Effects, the nail strips, but for me to pay $10 for nail strips, um, if I use them and try them, I can't really return it after I've used them, all 10, you know, for my nails. So I was like, you know what, I've been wanting to try it, but then I never really bought them. So I found this one, um, it's the Ready for Trouble number 180, so it's like a bright orangey color, it's not really red, but... These were $2.99, so I figured $2.99 is better than paying $10. So I'm going to give these a try. Let me know if you guys have used these and if you guys like them or, you know, what's the best way to put these on. Um, I have another nail polish that I'm going to do next after I take this black off, and it's this nice, bright, lemmy green. So I'm, I'm probably going to do these in a couple weeks, so um, just let me know. You can either let me know through Twitter or on a comment on this video. Also, uh, for Sally Hansen, I did a review on the um, Hard as Wraps Powerful Acrylic Gel on my blog. So if you're interested about knowing about this product, I will link my blog below. Um, so that's it for beauty. I got a dress. I haven't really bought myself like clothes, clothes for a really long time because I just I had a baby six months ago. Last year, all I bought was maternity things. So I got this dress um, for $7.99. I was like, I really cannot walk out of there without getting that dress because it'd be stupid if I didn't. And it was the last one, and I got it in a size small because starting on the first, I'm gonna start doing some workout stuff at home, and I'm gonna go running in the mornings. So, if you guys want to know about what I'm going to be doing, what my plans are to just, you know, get some muscles and be fit, let me know because I'll do a video showing you guys what I, not, I don't know if I should show you guys what I do or tell you, show you guys what I eat for my snacks, how I'm cutting back on my sweets and stuff. I don't know. If you want to know, I'll just, you know, film something for you guys. So, I got this dress. It's a long maxi dress. It's got a little bit of a sleeve, which is fine, a little bit of a pocket here, tiny little thing, $7.99, and the brand is called, let's see just love and it's actually you know pretty long so all the way down to the ground type of maxi dress which I've been wanting to get more of these dresses and those long like, maxi skirts for the summertime because when it's like right now it's over 100 degrees and it is 7 o'clock so it's ridiculously hot I'm just I'm gonna just die with this heat so I need dresses the more dresses I have the better it is it's just easy you throw on a dress Throw on some flip flops. I don't really have to pick a top, a bottom, pick out shoes or anything like that. I could just, you know, throw it on and just go. Throw some black flip flops and call it a day. That's what I'm all about. The easiest thing for me to do because I have a baby that requires more attention and I just, if I can just slip into a dress, I'm a happy girl. So that is it. That is all of my stuff that I got recently. I'm going to keep you guys posted on some of these things. If you want to know more, my initial you know, thoughts and reviews on some of these things, let me know because I'll film a video. Um, so just, you know, if you want to see that, let me know as soon as possible because I don't want to use these things for a little bit, a week or more, and then, you know, not be a first impression type of thing if that's what you want to hear. Um, but I will be doing reviews on this eventually in the next several weeks, so be on the lookout for that. I did film my favorites, so that video favorites will be up before this haul video. Um, and then a uh, tutorial for this look, if you're interested, will be up as well very soon. Um, so leave me also your requests for any certain tag videos, any questions that you may have that you want to ask me. I'm pretty much an open book. I'm more than happy to um, answer questions and let you guys into you know more of my personal life if you want to know. Um, any tutorials that you would like me to do. I want to do some more celebrity inspired looks, so if you have a celebrity in mind, leave it below and I will get to it as soon as possible. Also, follow me on Twitter because that's where I do my daily updates for when I'm filming, when I'm you know, editing, when a video is posted, so that's the easiest thing. If you don't check your subscription box on YouTube, you'll know if you follow me there. I'll put my um, username for Twitter below. My blog will be below, which I'm getting better at. I'm so proud of myself. Subscribe as well. I know it's a mouthful. Subscribe, you guys, because it is free, and um, show some support. I, you know, really love doing these videos, and I hope that you guys see that and that you guys enjoy my videos. Let me know what you want to see, because I do these videos um, for your enjoyment, so if you tell me what you want to see, it's going to be um, done on a video for you, and, you know, you will be more interested in my videos. So, And I will see you guys in my next video. Enjoy your summer, guys.